This is Kip, he's a little boy with Down syndrome. He is two and a half years old and walking with his dad. He has had jumpstart leapfrogs in the past, which have worked quite well for him. As you can see, he has a foot that is moderately pronated, uh, calcaneal valgus, a uh, midfoot that has collapsed with some forefoot abduction. He uses a lot of toe extension in ambulation. Kip has a lot of range of motion in both his uh, dorsiflexion and plantar flexion as well as his hind foot and uh, forefoot, as you would expect with any child with low muscle tone. The Jumpstart leapfrogs have worked quite well for him and we've decided to duplicate this style. He's got good range of motion to be able to accommodate a prefabricated brace. We are doing the initial fitting of the Jumpstart leapfrogs and typically what I do is I place the toe rise and then mark it with my fingernail. I then remove the brace and cut that marked line and then align the two leading edges of the toe rise with the leading edge of the plastic and bond them together. Doing a little trimming of the straps for proper tension and length. We wanted to show Kip walking with the orthosis without shoes just to see the alignment of the hind foot. He's got good vertical alignment of the hind foot and you can also tell that he has nice control of his forefoot. He brought in a pair of shoes and we're removing the insole and then just nip the two corners of the jump start to match uh, the insole. It will then go in easier and it will prevent the shoe from being cut. And here he is walking with shoes and braces. He's walking, he's quite comfortable with, the, with these orthoses. They're not limiting his mobility at all. He's able to walk in a normal fashion, he gets a good heel strike, foot flat, and toe roll off. So here Kip is standing. On the left, he's standing without his shoes and socks on. You can see the alignment prior to bracing with the hind foot in a everted position. And with braces on, the hind foot is nicely vertically aligned with shoes. And then looking at the picture from the frontal view, He's got a lot more external rotation of the legs and also valgus at the knees with the braces on because we've got nice medial longitudinal arch support. You'll see that he's got a normal toe out and his knees are in a proper alignment with his feet.